Now I can put up with a lot of things, but roaches ain't one. Besides inflation, I feel like that's gotta be one of the worst things that's happened to mankind. I just can never wrap my mind around the fact that those things are smaller than a big toe but cause so much heavy. But y'all know they're saying, I don't care where you go, but you gotta get the hell up out of here. So today what we're gonna be doing is going all throughout my project apartment, mopping every single floor. And come back and put some things down in hopes to never see one again. And feel more than welcome to come in here and give your girl some tips and advice on what you would do if you was in this situation. Y'all, I have been in this apartment for about three and a half, four years. What I'm not understanding is all throughout the whole time that I've been here, every other month, faithfully, we have the exterminator here to spray. I have never had roaches in this apartment. And if I did see one, it would be once in a blue moon, literally. But since last month to now, I've been seeing about two to three every freaking day. And I'm just not understanding it, because what did y'all come from and to me personally i feel like the worst thing about having a problem like this is that no matter what you do or what you put down as long as your neighbor still got roaches you gonna have them too so i feel like it kind of defeats the purpose of everything that i'm doing but i'm hoping that maybe they'll smell it so strong on this side they'll turn around and head back to wherever they came from because shoot my main problem is is at least if you're gonna be coming up in here chilling trying to soak up my air at least pay a bill shoot the rent, utility, Wi-Fi. Choose one shoe. I already got a gremlin up in here eating all the snacks. Ain't paying no bills. The last thing I need is another one. Now, I usually try to mop at least once every two weeks. But with everything that I had going on, I let a month go by. So, this is what my mop water looks like after one month of not mopping. Comment down below and let me know how often do you try to mop. Now, Publix had this comeback max gel on Boko. So, I grabbed two of those. And I'm just praying to God that it come in here and do its thug thizzle. And after I lay the comeback down, I'm coming in with the ortho home defense i've heard nothing but good things about this spray so i'm hoping that if the combat don't do it that the ortho will and as y'all can see i'm a rookie just hoping for the best you have any experience in this lane please let your girl know what's your go-to for killing off pests now the method that i'm going with is trying to get in every crack that i see because apparently when the maintenance man was calling they said renovating this apartment they left so many cracks in my baseboard and it kind of made me wonder is that where the roaches are coming from because Aren't these baseboards supposed to be caulked up? Granted, this is my first apartment. So I just don't feel like you should have gaps between your baseboard and the floor. But y'all, something gotta give. Because I know that I shouldn't be as terrified as I am of roaches. But baby, I'm telling you, if you ever want to rob me, just hold up a roach and you can get all my cash, my social security card, and all. Now, when I do see them, I usually see them in my bathroom. So I'm trying to make sure I get these come back in every crack and cranny that I can find. So after I finished up with the bathroom, then I headed outside with the ortho. Now I'm not sure if this gonna do anything, but hey, I feel like what does it hurt to try? So I sprayed it all around my door and on my steps. So y'all, let's just keep our fingers crossed and pray that this works. Now I plan on coming back in about two weeks and giving y'all an update on everything. Bye y'all.